What's up guys, John here from testprepinsight.com and today I'll be breaking down the Princeton Review MCAT prep course. And let me guess, you probably landed on this video because you're getting ready to start prepping for the MCAT and you're likely trying to nail down the best prep course to help guide your studies for the next few months. Luckily, I've actually purchased the Princeton Review MCAT prep course, used it to prep, evaluated all the different features like video lessons and practice problems. So hopefully I can offer you some solid advice today on how this course rates out, especially like others compared to Kaplan. So if you're ready for a deep dive into the analysis, let's get to it. All right, let's jump right into this thing. And I think it's probably gonna be most helpful for you if I break down the major features of this course, giving you my thoughts on them, and then circle back at the end for a quick recap of the highlights and lowlights of this Princeton course, and then maybe round it out with the final verdict on whether I would personally use Princeton for my MCAT prep. And if at any point during this video review you feel like you need some more info, there's three simple things you can do to do that. I'll throw a link down in the description over our website where we have a full detailed written review of the Princeton Review MCAT course. Or better yet, I'll drop in a link over to Princeton Review's website where you can check out the course for yourself. Or maybe even the easiest thing might be to just pop open a new tab and type in Test Prep Insight Princeton Review MCAT. That's a great way to get there too. Now let's kick it off by talking about the most important overall category out there, and that's the overall quality of Princeton's curriculum and coursework. And personally, in my opinion, I think Princeton provides one of the best all-around MCAT prep courses. Although there are a couple drawbacks. The first thing we'll say is that I loved Princeton's course structure. They bucket all their prep into seven general categories based on MCAT subject, then divide that material up further by subtopic. It's a really smart, natural way of breaking up tons of content. And when I say tons of content, I mean it when it comes to Princeton. They give you 500 plus on-demand video lessons, 2,500 or so practice problems, 16 full-length practice tests, and 123 live hours, assuming you're taking the live online course. This is a ton of study material, and maybe more than you'll ever need. Maybe, I'm not sure. But in terms of quality, Princeton generally crushes it here. And I say generally because the video lessons, which are at the heart of the on-demand class, have a shaky production quality. The audio is tinny, the picture isn't the sharpest, and the instructors are all business with their voiceover lesson, just cutting through the material. That said, if you don't care about the fluff and funny jokes or cartoons, these might be right up your alley. We found the substantive content of these video slides to be 100% on point and super comprehensive. So the production quality kind of sucks, especially when you see it side by side with Blueprint MCAT prep, but the content is rock solid. And I've got to mention the Princeton Review live online classes. These are what make this course. 123 hours of live class time with a team of rotating MCAT instructors is bananas. I mean, simply unheard of. And the value of these classes can't be overstated. The instructors are experts. The class sessions are crazy comprehensive. And I love the actionable tips and tricks you get out of them. Okay, so now that we got quality of course materials out of the way, let's talk pricing and course options. But real quick before I get to that, if I could ask you, subscribe to the channel, like this video, and drop us a comment below, that'd be appreciated. We work really hard to deliver helpful, honest content, so any support you could show us goes a long ways. Okay, so your options here. Princeton is gonna give you four different MCAT prep options. These include a self-paced course, ultimate course, MCAT 510 plus course, and a 515 plus immersion course. I know, that's a little overwhelming as they're really just variations of the same course. But there are some subtle differences here. The self-paced course is Princeton's base offering and is designed for students that want to drive their own studies and don't really need live classes. This comes in at around $1,700. Then there's the ultimate course, which is Princeton's most popular option and the one I took. This is going to come with that block of 123 hours of live online classes that I talked about. It prices out at around $2,800. Then there's the MCAT 510 plus and 515 plus immersion courses which are basically the same as the ultimate, but ratchet up the intensity and the level of coursework and also add in a unique score guarantee. The MCAT 510 plus course guarantees you a score of 510 or better and the 515 does the same with the promise of 515 or better that is. These are some really cool score guarantees that you just won't find elsewhere. Not Kaplan, not Blueprint, not Gold Standard. So if you're looking for a solid insurance policy or a company that really backs up its prep, Princeton is definitely gonna give you that warm and fuzzy feeling. And in terms of pricing, the Princeton prices are generally on par with other major prep providers like Blueprint and Kaplan, though not Magoosh. If you're balling on a serious budget and don't want to drop too much money on your prep, definitely check out our Magoosh review. I'll drop a link to that below in the description. 
And on the topic of budgets, Princeton Review is routinely running promos and discounts on these courses, which can usually save you up to a few hundred bucks. So I'll do my best to update the description below with any coupons or codes that might be floating around out there to help save you guys some cash. Okay, so next up we've got to talk prep books. And for me, these Princeton prep books are best in class. We've looked at close to 10 different MCAT prep programs by now, and honestly, none of their books stand up to Princeton's. You get 11 different prep books with your Princeton Review course, seven MCAT subject-specific content books, and four workbooks. These content review books are worth their weight in gold. They're comprehensive, detailed, and maybe most importantly, provide some awesome graphics and killer key point callouts. You'll read assigned sections as a primer for class, and they're a seriously nice complement to the core instruction. The workbooks are also solid in their own right, providing extra practice work, drills, and lessons. Not much else to say here other than they kind of help tie everything together. My personal thoughts on these books are that they are a key highlight of the course and almost worth as much as the video lessons themselves. They're well written, they're clearly articulated, and they do a great job breaking down complex material. For text-based learners, they're a huge value add. Okay, the last category to cover here today is practice material. And there's two things you need to keep in mind with this, quality and quantity. First, on the quantity side, Princeton Review is right in the middle of the pack. They give you 2,500 or so practice questions and 16 full-length simulated exams throughout their coursework. This is really bested only by blueprint and gold standard in terms of pure volume. So we had nothing to complain about in that regard. But more importantly than just the quantity, the quality of this practice work is rock solid, at least in my opinion. The actual practice questions are highly realistic of real MCAT questions in terms of length, difficulty, and content. And I especially like how Princeton tests material in a variety of ways. You get drills, diagnostic quizzes, full-scale practice problem sets, some problems in the books. It's just super helpful to get tested like this from all angles. It really helps you understand the underlying concepts. So all in all, Princeton gets high marks in the practice material column. All right, so let's start wrapping this video review up. And by the way, if you're studying for the MCAT, which I assume you are if you're watching this video, we give away a free prep course every single month as part of our giveaway club. If you want a chance to win that free prep course, you just have to do the three simple things that I'll throw up on the screen right here. I'll also toss the details down in the description below. It's super simple. It'll take you less than 30 seconds and you have a chance to win a free prep course, which could save you a few hundred bucks. Okay, so now that we've covered the details, let's take a bird's eye view here and look at the key takeaways. In terms of highlights of the Princeton Review MCAT course, I would say it has to be their live classes. No one can match these live online sessions. Then there's their top shelf prep books, which as I mentioned before, are about the best in this category. And finally, their course structure. I love the overall design, content, and flow of this course, which is easy to follow and digest. And on the con side, I have to say their video lesson production quality is just a little lackluster. And secondly, their price point for the classes with the special guarantees, those 510 and 515 plus courses just start pushing the upper bounds of most folks' budgets. Okay, so there you have it. I hope seeing this detail and the key highlights of this Princeton Review course has helped you with your decision. And I know for me personally, if I was considering Princeton Review for my MCAT prep, I would go with them no hesitation. I personally just think they offer one of the best all around MCAT prep courses out there, period. All right, that does it for this review. I hope this has been helpful. If you learned anything today or we helped you in any way, make sure to subscribe to our channel, like this video and drop us a comment below. That would be hugely appreciated. And if you want any more content about the MCAT, maybe some detailed course comparisons or reviews, make sure to check out our website, testprepinsight.com, where we have a ton of great written content all about the MCAT. All right, as always, best of luck, and we'll see you guys in the next one.